Hello my friends, Debbie here with Debbie Gets Crafty and I just have a little bit of an unbagging today. I got these five paintings from FG Normal and I've had them for quite a while and I'm just getting around now to doing a video uh, but I wanted to show you what these paintings were. So I got five paintings, two larger ones and three smaller ones. So we'll start with the ones that are, are not in covers first. And I think I'll do the big one first. And I hope everybody is having a wonderful day. Uh, I'm actually, this is a Sunday that, that I uh, am posting this. And Judy from All Fired Up Crafting Lounge, she and I uh, just rounded out our birthday weekend and we have had the time of our lives. It was so much fun. Uh, it all started off on my channel on Friday night. We had a pajama party and um, then we carried it over to Saturday, yesterday, when we did um, a two-hour show on my channel. And then we rounded off our birthday weekend today by uh, having a one-hour show on Judy's channel. And uh, that's all Fired Up Crafting Lounge on YouTube. And you can catch us at our Facebook group page. We've just recently updated the name. And our new name for our Facebook group page is Sassy Crafting Sisters and Misters so that we want to be inclusive of everybody. We want everybody to be able to feel comfortable and join in, have some fun, share some uh, great crafting um, pictures and stories and connect with other folks that craft as well. And we certainly hope you can make your way over there and join our group of merry crafters and enjoy the fun that we have there as well. So I just wanted to show these paintings. We'll take a moment to take a look at this one first. And I'm going to just go ahead and give this a little roll. This is poured blue, so it is forgiving. It will allow you to handle it in a uh, in a little way in ways that will help it to relax. You can roll it up and help the canvas relax because it's been rolled up in a... There we go. All right. So we'll start here. And of course, we'll start with our toolkit, which is your basic toolkit. This is a standard toolkit that you should get with every diamond painting that you receive. And it has your pink pen, your green boat, and your pink wax. This is everything you would need to start, work on, and finish your diamond painting. So every kit should come with something, at least these pieces of equipment to help you put your painting together. And these are the colors, and we will get into those in a little deeper dive in just a moment, but we've got some really nice rich colors here. And there is no label defining where, what painting it goes to. So I will be putting a label on these, on this bag, because I like to store my drills separate from my canvas, because I like to lay my canvas flat and get the, uh, get the wrinkles out of it. So I'll definitely put the canvas number on here on a label so this way I'll know when I go to grab this canvas to work on it I'll know which drills belong to it. So we'll look at those in a minute and we're going to go ahead and look at this painting right now. Isn't that adorable? I think that's a red raccoon I'm fairly certain that's a red raccoon. If I'm mistaken, please correct me in in the comments below. But I just thought he was so adorable. And he's got a stack of pancakes on the top of his head. He's balancing a stack of pancakes with a fried egg, a sunny side egg on the top. And I just thought he was so stinking cute. 
and he is 25 colors. He is a 40 by 40 round drill. It looks like it's the new style of uh, the, the way that they print the picture so it's not pixelated. And you, it's a really nice clear picture even off camera. Uh, it's a nice clear picture. Let's take a look here. It's got of course the poured glue which is a great stick. And let me just go ahead and try to relax this canvas a little bit more. And again, this came from FG Normal. These are items that I purchased myself with my money. And I just uh, saw a few of these pictures and of course they were running a great sale. And I thought, why not? I'm gonna take advantage of the sale. There we go. And what I'm doing here is just peeling this protective cellophane sheet back and I'm just rolling it back gently onto the painting. Once you pull that protective cellophane back, it helps to relax the painting. And then when you put it back, most of those wrinkles and the fold lines, they go away. They relax as well. There we go. But I just thought it was a really cute painting. And I just thought I'd share that with you. Looks like he's enjoying his breakfast. Now I will post the prices and the links down below in the description where you can pick this up. Now I do want to let you know, like I said, there's 25 colors. They are in number, in numeric order, and then in alphabetical order as well. And then I'll show you the thumbnail. Let me just peel this back a little bit. There we go. Whoop. You can tell it's been a while since I've done an unbagging. There we go. And that's the thumbnail. Isn't he adorable? So that's our little breakfast raccoon. Raccoon visiting for breakfast. And let's take a look at our drills. And again, this does not have any number, any sticker listed. So I will be putting a sticker on there to identify which painting this goes to. And I'm going to take them out because I don't care how they go back in. I will not keep them in the bags when I go to work on it. I like to kit up into a uh, container so it doesn't bother me if I take them out and mix them up. Matter of fact, let me grab a sticker and a pen and when I'm done then I'll go ahead and mark the the bag. So here's just a run through of some of the colors. Go ahead and bring that down a little. There we go. So you have some nice orangey tans and the blues. It's a nice gray. Compliments that coral color. I like that color. It's like a light mauve. Nice mocha color. I like that periwinkle blue. Of course, because he's that red raccoon, you have more of the oranges and the reds. Pretty purple. I like that cream color. I love this butter color. Love it.
There we go. So we'll go ahead and make an attempt to put these in, not in order, because like I said, I'll go through and figure that out. But try to put them in so they'll lay flat. Let's see, like an accordion. Have to spread them out. So I just thought that was a fun, just something fun. He was just so stinking cute that I wanted to get him. And at some point in time, I'll, I'll work on him. There we go. Perfect. All right. And now we'll bring him back here. And let me just write down the number okay so red raccoon Of course, I picked the smallest stickers known to mankind, but that's okay. There we go. So that's one. That's the first one. And now we'll get to one of our smaller kits. Alrighty, I know you're here somewhere. And nope, that's because you're up here. Remember I said I had a birthday, folks? Getting old. Not that I'm getting, I am there, I'm old. That's okay. Alright. And so we'll go ahead. Your basic toolkit. Now this one is a little different because not only does this have your pink pen, your green boat and your wax but it also has a four placer for the pen and that's the skinny four placer and that's a nice one so and that's your typical toolkit and again there are no identifying numbers so I will put a sticker on that I'm just gonna flip this one over and roll it this is a 30 by 30. And there we go. And I'm going to bring you back up. Oh, I said back up, not down. There we go. So this is a 30 by 30 round drill. It has 21 colors and you'll see it's got a legend on the top left, lower right. It also has a thumbnail on each side and the numbers and the symbols are numbers and alphabetical order. That's all in order. You also with the other painting and with this painting the DMC numbers are included and again, it is in the newer style of printing. Isn't that adorable? I'm going to flatten him out real quick. I just thought he was so cute. And oh my gosh, friends, wouldn't this be adorable in a baby's room? I just think it would be so cute in a nursery. But years ago, I used to collect teddy bears. I don't anymore, uh, but I used to years ago, and he would have been perfect to add to my collection. And 
ones. So I'm not going to take these drills out because they are, um, you can see pretty much all of the, you know, all of the different colors. There's some great muted colors in there, the pretty sky blue and the tans and the cream colors. And you got some darker brown that goes in. So let me go ahead and label this as well. And let's see. Okay. Eight, two. All right. So we'll make sure that goes there. Perfect. And also, the stick on this, it is poured glue. The stick is great. 30 by 30. Again, this came from FG Normal. I will post the link to where you, you can get this and the price down in my description box. Again, these were all purchased with my own money. So we're going to go on to the next And this will be my final one for this video. And then I'll do the two that I have that are in uh, the protective covers. I'll do those in a separate video because my battery is running out. So, all right. So you get your typical basic standard toolkit, green boat, pink pen, pink wax. Everything you need to do this painting. This does have the number of the canvas on it. It does not have DMC codes on the beads themselves, but let's check this picture out. I thought this was so pretty. This is also a 30 by 40. And isn't that beautiful? It, this reminds me of summertime, so I'm probably going to save this for something next year to do. But I love it with the fireflies and the candles and the purple. There's so many friends here on, face, on uh, YouTube and Facebook that love the purple sweet tea this is speaking to you my friend with the purple and i just thought this was so lovely and i love hydrangeas so that that's what sold me on it it's a 30 by 40 there are 22 colors there is a legend on the top left lower right and there is a thumbnail let me bring that up it's not a really well, i guess it's okay the thumbnail Okay, and they are, the symbols are letters, but they are in, uh, they're not in any type of order, all right, but it does have the DMC codes with it, so that's good. So let's go ahead, we'll take a quick look at the drills. There we go. Here we are. So we have here some really pretty blues and the, the dark tan, really pretty greens. Got some browns, some bluish gray, some slate. I love the cream color. Oh, and here we are with the purples. Purple and, and gray go so nicely together, and I'm so sorry for the light. This is a new setup in my crafting room, so I'm trying to get uh, the light situation settled. But you have a basic idea about the colors. And then the last two colors is the cream and the white. So these are the colors in this particular pack. For this diamond painting so let's see if we can't get these in here won't be perfect but it'll be done there we go and again i don't have to label this because it does have the canvas number on the front of the label so and again I'll show this to you 
30 by 40. I just love the, the theme. It just brings me back to growing up in the summer evenings in the backyard with the fireflies and just enjoying the warmer weather. We're coming up to cooler weather. Fall is here. It's in full bloom, full swing. So we're getting into the cooler weather now, but this can be done next year for a project or if there's an event. This might work for Diamond Grandma's garden event. So that's this one for today, and I'll show you the, the, the two other ones that I have. I got these all from FG Normal, so we have this 30 by 40. We also have this 30 by 30 of the teddy bear, and we have this 40 by 40 of the red, I'm calling him a red raccoon, enjoying breakfast. And the next video, I will show the last two that are in these protective packages. These are all from FG Normal. I bought these with my own money. And I just wanted to say thank you so much for subscribing to my channel. Uh, if you've not yet subscribed, please consider subscribing. Please hit the like button. Leave me a comment and hit that bell notification. So when I do load up a video, you'll know and you can watch it. I just want to say thank you again for stopping by. Please be kind to one another. Be good to yourself. Watch out for your friends, your family, and all of your pets of any type. And look after each other. Until we see each other again, my friends, I want to say thank you. You have a great day. Goodbye now.